Hey, don't you know these are dangerous streets we walk around? Do you know where you're at right now? You're on my block. You know what happens when you're on my block, right? You don't act straight. You get a cap in your ass. So what is it gonna be? You need to turn around, or I'm gonna have to teach you a lesson. Yeah, 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 keep talking, keep running your mouth. I know exactly what the type you are. You say you take a wrong turn, right? I know exactly what you're here for. You snitch. I know you a snitch. You know what? I could see the damn wire in your tight ass shirt. Tell me, who sent you? Mm -hmm. I knew it was them. I knew it was them. Uh, well, uh, I'm gonna keep you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm gonna keep you as a threat to those motherfuckers over there who think they can snitch out to the police about our organization. They think that they can take us out because they have authority on their side. <laughs> No, no, no. That's not how it's gonna work over here. Now you gonna be with me now. And I'm gonna threaten them for more money. And I'm gonna threaten your life. Yeah. So don't be acting crazy, bub. Or bad shit's gonna happen to you. You understand? You hear me? I said, do you understand? And do you hear me? Good. Good. Now. We gotta be chilling here for a little bit. Get inside. But don't make me shoot you. I said get inside. There you go, there you go, chop chop. All right. Most of the crew is out right now. They're doing the daily walks and shit like that, you know? We have, we have a bunch of cats here too. Alley cats, but we don't really mind them. Uh, take a seat anywhere. I don't give a fuck. You want a drink or something? <laughs> uh, you're funny. You're funny, kid. You're funny. We don't have water over here. Well, we do, but that's not what we drink. We got hard liquor. You want some Hennessy? Fireball? What? What? what what's your poison? Bourbon? What? Pick your poison. Which one do you want? All right, bourbon or nice? I get you. All right, this will get you some uh, hair on your chest, I guess. Well, me, I'm more of a whiskey type of guy. Whiskey on the rocks, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. So why'd you do it? They give you money. They said they'll protect you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yo, it was for the money. I should have known. Listen, you're going through a dangerous game right now. Yeah. If I was somebody different from this crew, you would have been shot by now. But me? I'm a more different kind of person. I like to play mind games with the enemy. You feel me? Yeah, yeah, mind games. Mind games. And we get an extra little bit of profit off of it as well. So, yeah. 
I like to play more games. Well, I mean, money is money, no matter how you get it. It, it could be from pimping, it could be from stealing, robbing, hell, even some killing. Robbing just is basically how we live, in all honesty. That's how we got this place. That's how we got everything. We rob places, we rob people, kill people. That's how it is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I get you. What if we get caught? We have the money to bail out almost every single one of us. We keep our money. We keep our money straight. We don't really spend it on anything in general. Unless we really need it. The liquor is a necessity. Don't ever disapprove of the liquor. This is how we live. This is how we have fun. Hell, even sometimes liquor leads us to do the stuff that we do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Liquor is sometimes a fun time. <laughs> and sometimes liquor is how you get laid. It's a sad truth, but it's the truth nonetheless. <laughs> that reminds me of a story where I'm, uh, I was at this uh, college party once, right? I was, like, younger than I am now. Yeah, yeah. Well, I... <laughs> Don't look at me like that. I I'm an older dude. I may look young, but trust me, I'm, like, 29, 28. Yeah, when I was, like, younger, I, I was at a college party, right? And, uh, there was a, a semi-pro bartender, and, um, he was being my wingman for the night. And there was this really hot chick. Yeah, yeah. And she had some, you know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> You could say she was packing a few shotguns, as you know what I'm saying. A few eight balls. Uh, not a few, but... And there was some big eight balls, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> Up and, yeah, okay. Anyway, I'm I'm going off topic. Um, he was my wingman for the night, and um, he made this super strong drink. Like I had a sip of it, and I thought my vision was going. But no, that that shit was just strong as hell. And he said, "Give this to the girl." She'll follow you no matter what. And I said, okay, bet, okay. I did. <laughs> Next thing I know, about five minutes later, I have a screaming head off in the bedroom. <laughs> oh, that was such a good time, good time. <laughs> of course I got a number. I think I still have it on my phone somewhere. Just gotta find my phone. Mm hmm. Yeah, it was a good time. Good times. Back then. But now... Now I do this. How do I get my money? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. Basically, I rob banks. I also pimp on the weekends. Yeah, I'm a pimp. That's how I get my extra money. It's illegal. But that's how I get it. If in these streets, you gotta make some money somehow. You don't get a profit, you don't live. That's how the world is. Especially with this economy. You don't have any type of money, you're dead. That's it. You don't have money, you're dead. That's how we lost, like, my friend Rico back in the day. He got in the gangs and, well, <laughs> Yup. Lost him to a gang member. Got him right between the eyes. 
Ain't no one living through a gunshot through the eyes. <clears throat> anyway. Well, of course I miss him. He was one of my best friends back in the day. When I was like, I want to say 25 or something like that. He was a nut, he was a nutcase, but I loved him. I loved him like he was a brother. Well, that's where we all, well, we're all family over here, in all honesty. We just do illegal stuff. <laughs> you know what? Why, 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 why go to the police and try to ruin our family business? And, like, ruin our family in general, huh? I know it's because of the money, but, like, why do it? Why side for the enemy side? You know what you could do? You could be making millions and thousands of dollars uh, right now. Okay, yeah, right now. If you would just take off that wire and smash it onto the ground. Stomp your foot right into that motherfucker. No evidence. And then you come work with us. We'll make you a happy rich man. Your family. Will have protection. Actual protection. You have a second family. And I won't kill you, so. Seems like a fair deal to me, not gonna lie. So what is it you're gonna do? You gonna take that wire, take everything I've been saying. Take it to the police and make a quick buck, maybe a, a grand or so. Or are you going to stick around here and make your family rich and live a very, very happy life? Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right, brother. All right. <laughs> Welcome to the team. Welcome to the family, actually. I'll take care of the wire for you. I know how to deactivate them without the police trackers. Yep. Uh, would you want another bourbon? I got you, brother. I got you. Welcome to the family. And don't turn your back on us. You might get killed. <laughs> You're welcome anyway. <laughs> 